Hello everyone and welcome back. In today's video we are doing a makeover of our downstairs powder room. I had started painting the walls a few months ago and I was not able to finish decorating it so I'm so excited to finally share the completed decorating process with you. If you're new to our channel, welcome to our Glam family. We appreciate all the love and support you receive on this channel and glad to share all of our ideas with you. Here's a look of the bathroom before the makeover. We have wanted to change the look of this bathroom for a while now and decided to make it more modern, just with a few changes. If you would like to see how we complete our powder room makeover, just keep on watching. So first things first guys, I'm going to clean my floor with this new mop I purchased on Amazon. I saw it on TikTok and decided to try it out. It was very inexpensive. It cost around maybe say 40 bucks and it's good for cleaning your tile or hardwood floor. As you can see, the floor is nice, shiny and clean. I definitely recommend using this. I purchased this glass shelf from Home Depot and I installed it a few weeks ago but I didn't really get a chance to decorate it the way I really wanted to. So today I'm going to be starting with this soap dispenser that I purchased from HomeSense and I thought it would go well with my decor when I saw it. I love the white and silver base and so far it's uh, working out okay. I'm going to be adding these two jars that I purchased from Dollar Tree which I filled with some cotton balls and q-tips and here's a simple quick DIY I did on the jars and all I did was just wrap the top and bottom with rhinestone wrap that I purchased from Amazon and all I did was just measure and cut two pieces to fit the size top and bottom and I just used hot glue to secure all the pieces together. Now I'm going to put these face cloths in the center of my shelf and uh, these are actually from HomeSense and a pack of four only cost $9.99 so as you can see again guys it was very inexpensive. I was going to take the ribbon off but I thought it looked real cute so I just left it on. For my candle holder, I was a little undecided where I was going to put it. I was thinking maybe I put it in the back, but I decided to put it in the center. And uh, this actually is a DIY makeover I did a few weeks ago. So please go and check out the video, guys. I will leave a link on the top of the screen. I'm going to complete my shelf with a small vase that I also purchased from HomeSense which was about $5.99 and I added some cute white flowers to complete the look. I bought the flowers from Dollar Tree and here's the final look of my shelf guys. I think it turned out real beautiful. I'm going to be using this bowl to display my toilet paper. I thought it would make it a little bit more easy and convenient to access them as well as make them look a little bit more organized. I bought it from HomeSense for only $19.99. This is how the bowl looked before. I spray painted it silver and all I did was just added some rhinestone to the top with hot glue. Purchase this towel set. It comes in a pack of six from HomeSense for only $29.99. It comes with two bath towels, two hand towels, and two washcloths. It has the same pattern as the face cloth that I use on my shelf, as you can see. And here is how I place them on the rack. They look absolutely beautiful, clean, and help to brighten the space. I bought these mats from HomeSense. Again, the cost was very inexpensive. The mats has the silver sparkle, which looks really, really beautiful. And the cost was only $29.99. I've had this wall decor for a long time now. I can't remember exactly where I purchased it, 
but I decided to use it in this space and I wasn't sure what I wanted to do just to glam it up a little bit but I decided to add some rhinestone wrap that I purchased from Amazon just to you know brighten it up a little bit so I decided to add it in the middle of the wall in the bathroom and um, it turned out to work perfectly here is a picture of the lighting we had before and we're so happy that we decided on this crystal lighting. We purchased it from Amazon for $98.99. The quality of this lighting is amazing and the crystal sparkles when the lights are on. So we are really happy with this purchase. Here is a picture of the ceiling before and here is the after. We installed the crown moldings around the ceiling. This upgrade totally enhanced the design of the space. We also changed out the switch plates and replaced the white ones with silver ones which give an added touch to the space as well. Here is a before picture of the mirror and the faucet. Uh, the new faucet we purchased from Home Depot at a cost of $76.98 and the octagon mirror we purchased from HomeSense at a cost of $199.99. We love how the mirror fits perfectly and how it completes the bathroom. So here is the complete finished look. We're so happy with this powder room makeover. The washroom looks amazing. We hope this video inspires you into doing your bathroom makeover. Please let us know down in the comment what you think of our washroom makeover. And if you decided to do a makeover of your washroom or anywhere in your home, please send us some pictures on our Instagram page. We'll leave that link down below. We would love to hear from you and appreciate all the love and support. Thank you for watching today's video. Please like, comment, and share. Also, don't forget to check out our latest video on Instagram. And as always, guys, stay safe and may God bless.